Welcome back. Taking a full look at weather now. Meteorologist Lisa Montgomery. Lisa, we needed a little thin, thinner sweater today, <laughs> <laughs> right? It felt like we were cooling down already. Yeah, it was a cooler day, especially around the coast, even around the peninsula. Temperatures stayed in the upper 50s to the low 60s, where inland we did have the upper 80s in some spots. So comfy inland, very warm inland with lots of sunshine. Uh, we did get to see uh, sunshine along the coast today. That probably won't be the coast uh, case tomorrow. Uh, around the southern part of the bay and the peninsula, but don't worry, the weekend's looking fantastic, very summer-like. Right. Yeah, so let's take a look, and we'll show you your weather headlines then. We're gonna be staying cool with the coast, and those clouds are sticking around. In fact, we've got a thicker marine layer for tonight, maybe even a little bit of drizzle in some spots too for tomorrow morning. Certainly good news, we like to see some of that moisture move in here, especially when we have some fire risks, right? We've got all the dry conditions out there and lots of very warm sunshine, so uh, that looks good and we do have uh, warmer temperatures inland so we're still going to see that for tomorrow but those temperatures really ramp up as we head into the weekend with clear skies everywhere across the central coast so it probably will be a good weekend to head to the beach look what's happening just to the east of the area Modesto Fresno this whole entire area under a heat alert it is a, a heat advisory for those numbers they will be climbing into the triple digits. So we're not under any kind of heat alert, but we're gonna watch for that, especially as we head into Saturday. Some areas, especially those southern sections of the Salinas Valley could be in the triple digits. So we still have to use caution. We still have to be careful and be safe for this weekend. Everybody's gonna see those warmer temperatures. Right now though, we've got some cool conditions along the bay. And of course it's a little bit warmer inland. We're still seeing the upper 50s and the 60s here, but we're all gonna fall back into the upper 40s into the low 50s overnight, but we do have a lot more cloud cover out there. Look at this. So it is a deeper marine layer really spilling inland. Take a look at this all around the bay up through Morgan Hill, Gilroy, Hollister, down through the Salinas Valley. So we're going to be waking up to some clouds, but then they will retreat back to the coast and it looks like they will be sticking around mostly for the Monterey area uh, east of the bay there, possibly even Salinas. Everybody else will have some clearing skies, plenty of sunshine, and that's going to warm those areas up a bit by a few degrees. So a little bit warmer tomorrow Then that big warm up begins on Friday. So overnight tonight, we're looking at the low 50s for around the bay, pretty much what we've had the last several nights. And Futurecast is showing you a uh, very quiet weather pattern, but again, we've got the marine layer, so it's gonna retreat back during the day and we'll see the sunshine, the warmer conditions, and we'll see it fill back in for Friday morning as well. We are still looking at those clouds and that marine layer. Things will begin to shift though as we head into Friday afternoon, Saturday and Sunday. We're gonna see sunshine everywhere all across the coast. It's all due to this trough that's gonna move out of here and allow high pressure to build in. And you can see by the colors here on the map, the darker colors mean the warmer temperatures. We've got a ridge that's gonna build in for the weekend and that's what's gonna be warming us up. Sunday will be very warm too. And then we begin to slowly cool off again and getting back to normal as we head into next week, the work week. So get ready for a very warm weekend. Here's a look at your forecast then for tonight. Overnight, again, we're gonna be right around 50 degrees. Temperatures tomorrow, a little bit warmer depending on where you are. Santa Cruz, 72. Boulder Creek will be in the 80s. Ben Lomond, 79. And then east of the Bay Salinas, our high today was 64. We'll be at 66 tomorrow. Hopefully we'll see the sunshine. Prunedale, 65. Morgan Hill, 85. Aptos staying in the 60s. The same with Marina, staying cool with 60 degrees. Same for the peninsula, you can expect more of the same. We're going to be in the upper 50s to the low 60s tomorrow uh, with those clouds kind of lingering through much of the day. Inland, we'll see the sunshine. So guess what? Warmer already in the 90s for Bradley, Parkfield, San Antonio Valley, in the 80s for King City. The Pinnacle's near 90. Carmel Valley, 74. Big Sur will stay in the mid 60s. So all across the board here, we're looking at some quiet weather, some dry conditions. Uh, we'll have those clouds around for Thursday and then hopefully afternoon we will see the sun for the coastal communities but take a look at this temperatures Saturday is the peak heat day both coastal and inland we could be in the 70s in a lot of areas Sunday just as warm and then we cool off as we head into next week same for those inland areas be careful be safe for the weekend we're looking at some very warm numbers here and then we'll cool off slightly next week looking forward to the warmer weather thank you Lisa